Okay, so I didn't really see how bad my hair looks, but it looks like crap. Anyways, I thought I'd make a video today because it's been so long, and when you don't make a video after so long, people forget about you. I learned that from Gary Vaynerchuk, and it's so true. If you look at Lil Wayne and like other people, like P. Diddy, well, no one forgot about him. No, I forgot that one I got caught um like dating or like something with a 17 year old i don't know anyways guys that's not the point based on the title from this video as you can see i'm trying to tell you do your homework because i you know for many reasons actually one of them is because we have the opportunity to go to school and actually you know make something out of our lives most times not always School isn't a guarantee to success, just so you know that. There's so many people that have become successful without a college degree. Most of them have become more successful than those with a degree. So that's just one thing to keep in mind. Also, if you look at the world, there's like what? Well, there's a hundred of countries, but I'm not exactly sure how many of them have access to school and how many of them have access to internet. All I know is that there's over 1 billion people that don't have access to internet. And that really shocked me just because, you know, just you watching this, me making this video, you know, there's internet. But a lot of people don't, how would you say? Sorry, I'm crossing the street right now. But a lot of people don't take advantage of it. They just, I don't know how to say it. They just spend their time on it versus like they could be doing something with it. Yeah. But anyways, guys, I'm a college student for those of you that don't know. And I'm pretty much going to college for free. I got a scholarship that's pretty much paying everything off. And the thing that's shocking is that I'm late on homework. Now, what do I mean by that? What I mean is that even though I'm going to school for free, I'm late on my uh, late on some work on my classes. And because of that, I don't know, I just been so behind to the point where I had to make a video about how I'm taking, I'm not, how would you say? Taking advantage of? No, it's not the best word. I don't know, but let's just say I am pretty much doing whatever I want even though there's people out there that would kill for my opportunity. Like, I once was dating this chick, she was... Yeah, let's just say she couldn't pay for college, you know? And the thing about not being able to pay for college or not having any other way of paying it off, not even loans or anything, is that they really wish that they could go to college. And the fact that I'm going for free, but I'm late on my work and I have the time to do it because you know I go to college with like adults and all that and they're always like well they're not always but when I talked to them they were like you know uh, I own a business I have to take care of my kids uh, most of them have to take care of kids they have work they have this they have that and I'm like damn you know that's a lot and the thing about me is you know I just got school so I don't work anymore. I'm unemployed at the moment. I'm not happy about it, but I don't know what to look for in a job, but I'm still looking, even though I have the month's rent and all that. So that's what really matters. But you see, we don't take advantage of the opportunity. Why is it that the people that have the least wish they could do what the ones that have more can? Like one thing I learned because my parents are from Mexico. Um, how would you say? Yeah, they're from Mexico. So, And they're from like the countryside. So the city and everything was new to them. Here, I'm going to start walking back. You know what? Let's go this way. So yeah, the city was new to them and everything. They're just from a countryside, you know? So they know work. That's all they know. And the thing is, if you don't work out there, you don't survive. 
And that's something that really caught my attention. You know, uh, that's why you see so many immigrants coming here and doing the hardest jobs because they're used to it, you know? Like, that's all they know. They pretty much have to do that to survive. And the fact that they're doing that and getting paid for it now is even better. At least, you know, coming from that perspective, I think so. I can't say because I've never been over there, so I don't know. Look at the little doggies. I don't go walking around here much, so it's kind of awkward. But you see, why is it that people that have the opportunity don't take advantage of it? You know, like, <laughs> so many people in other countries, I'm pretty sure, wish they could start a business, but yet they don't because they can't. <laughs> Versus here, you could just get money from a bank and start it, which is what I plan to do, but yet I haven't done it because I'm learning the business aspect. And the thing about learning something that you never know, that you never knew of, is that you have to constantly be learning. Like I learned about the Barnes and Oxley Act. Uh, I learned like I'm learning taxes and all that. You could pretty much set your taxes in a way where you don't have to do them because uh, you like something with the business. I forgot about it. But yeah, you guys know how you heard like Trump not doing his taxes. That's legal, actually, the way he's doing it because there's a legal way of doing it. And these are the little things that people don't know about, like marketing, advertising, uh, a business plan, you know, management, employees, um, ads uh when you click on something on the website it should link them towards exactly what you want them to not towards what they're not looking for so little things like that that make a big difference and watching kitchen nightmares i believe it <laughs> for those of you that don't know kitchen nightmares it's a it's a show where you pretty much watch kitchen nightmares <laughs> it says it in the title it's gordon ramsay for those of you that don't know him he's one of my idols uh he takes no one's shit and he knows how to turn like one of the worst restaurants out there into like a five-star restaurant 70 percent of them failed after like three months at least from what i read but i'm pretty sure that's due to management <laughs> so yeah guys i just figured i'd talk about homework and taking opportunities because so many of us have the opportunity, sorry, the opportunity to do something, but yeah, we don't do them. And what I want to get at is why, you know, why is it that we have these chances, but don't take advantage of them? Is it because they're there? Is it like, is it, does it go like the saying, um, you don't miss something unless it's gone? You know, so like, there's people missing or like wanting to go to school. Versus people that are going to school, but yet don't want to be there. Do you guys know what I mean? So, yeah. Anyways, I thought I'd make a quick video, especially about homework because, well, I was taking a shower. I took a shower because I went for a run. And I figured I need to do homework. I'm really behind on my things. So, I figured doing them would be the best thing. Anyways, guys, this is your friendly neighborhood, Geo. Signing out.